so there's about 15,000 public defenders in America, which is a remarkably low number if you think about it. Um, essentially, every public defender has in common the following. They will be assigned their client essentially randomly. They will not be paid by that client. They will be paid by a, you know, it varies, but they will be paid by a different, usually governmental source. And they will ag agree um, essentially to function as that person's attorney for the life of the case. So we spoke about arraignments being the beginning of a criminal case. You stand up next to the, the defendant as they get arraigned. They usually enter a plea of, of not guilty um, or, or sometimes enter a plea of guilty and the case is over. But uh, when we're talking about a case that lives for a while, they enter a plea of not guilty. You're that person's attorney. You are charged essentially with not giving them a fair trial, not seeing that they're treated fairly. No, you're charged with achieving the best possible result for that individual. You've essentially agreed to be that person's um, only protection, really, against, uh, as I said, what I've referred to before as this rather toxic machine that um, is especially in existence in the United States. So essentially, the work is uh, it can be difficult, and mainly because if if there is this toxic machine, and if it is growing exponentially, and if you know the rate of incarceration has quintupled in a few decades, what does that mean? Well, that means you have a lot of clients. Obviously, there's a lot of people being arrested, and there's only 15,000 public defenders in the country, and most people that are arrested can't afford a lawyer. So essentially, what 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 marks if if you had to pick one salient feature of what it means to be a public defender in the United States is this feeling of being uh, deluged with work that you can't really quite get a handle on the way you would like. So, for example, if 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 you or your brother or sister were to be charged with a crime tomorrow, with the possibility of being incarcerated and having their liberty taken, I would suspect that you would want every possible uh, rock turned over to see if there's anything that could possibly avoid this horrific result. Um, and I think that there's nothing wrong with that. And that's how the 70 to 80 people that I represent at any given time feel. And that's how they should feel. And that's how I feel for them. But um, I am one person. And there are 80 people who want me um, exhausting every possible legal maneuver. And as you can see, there are only so many hours in the day. And so what ends up happening is, as I said, the overwhelming sensation is one of being deluged um, with work that can't quite be adequately handled.